it's nice to know I still got it. Especially since I have a concert in a bit. Oh, shit. Oh, Ooh. this is her. Okay. Concert? Wait. Oh, shit. That's you. Go. Wait. You're the Lilum that's putting on a concert tonight? I'm one Lilum who is putting on a concert tonight. I don't know if I'm the same Lilum you're looking for. I just... I gotta point this out. I fucking Yeah, no. That this. guy's great. I love this that This is shit. the best thing ever. Jesus Christ, I'm lightheaded. <laughs> Me too. I fucking... I'm sweating a little bit. <laughs> I really got God, into is that. This, is this what fucking exercise counts as now? Yeah. For us and gamers. what are you doing all the way down here? Well, they were making last preparations for the concerts, so I snuck out. Oh, My producer oh, oh. is always obnoxious while that's going on, so I just decided to leave. That's a good option. She options saw, liked the shit out of it. Yeah, that. she options liked the fuck out of it, dude. I saw one of the concert's posters outside and decided to check this place. Just that? Isn't that a bit dangerous? I was going to say pretentious, but... <laughs> <laughs> Won't your producer be mad when you go back? He will, but it's not the first time I've done this. And he still needs me to do the concert anyway. He's got a good point. I... I see... How big is the concert? As big as my fucking tits. <laughs> so we managed to secure ourselves another show in a couple of weeks. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. I may not have as many fans as other performers, but mine are very loyal, and that's nice. Over 100,000 is not many? Then what exactly small, is? Small YouTubers calling themselves yeah. small YouTubers. <laughs> Hold on, and then based on your little demonstration from before, I should call you Miss Mickey, right? You don't get it! Let's start from the top. I'll just call you Miss Idol then. Oh, I like that. Hey, do you have anything soft? Soft? As in alcohol-free? No, I mean soft as in soft. Soft? Uh, let's see what I can get you. <laughs> Fuck, man. Why She's do I an do this every day? <laughs> She's uh, so pretentious and Ojo Salmish. It's great. Yeah. This is beautiful. So soft isn't actually one of the things on here, but I remember this is definitely soft. Oh, you think it's a fluffy like dream, this? dude. Fuck yeah. All right, three of those. Three of those. Let's give her like two carbatrine. That sounds good, right? Yeah, give her. Fill it. Fill it up to the rest of the carbatrine. I don't. She's just, I don't want to do that. All right. I mean, she's a robot, so I don't know yeah. if she get drunk or not. But. You think robots get drunk? Uh, maybe. Robo drunk? They're humanoid. I mean, yeah, this will do. Thanks. Hey, have you considered being more theatrical when mixing drinks? <laughs> eh? Huh? Yeah, you know, like spinning the bottles, lighting drinks on fire, that kind of stuff. You can't make her freeze her. <laughs> Shit, you're, you're right. Spinning bottles. <laughs> <laughs> she just sounds like she'd be British. Hey, she she's fucking freezes what she is. <laughs> I'll take it. I'll do it. I'll bake her. When I was in college, I tried to go going to a party once. The bartender who tried those tricks gave me a nasty bump on the forehead when the bottle slipped his hand. Those kind of theatrics usually feel pointless and seem to slow down the process of actually making a drink. Yeah, but. Never underestimate the power of putting on a good show. Yes, Goku. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes, Goku, I understand. I understand you are mad about your planet, after all. <laughs> I'll keep it in mind. Hmm. Hey, is this glass important? Depends on why you're asking. <laughs> Do you want me to sign it? Oh, sure, I guess. No guessing. Are you sure or not? Yeah. Do as you please. Okay, then. Who should, would I make this out to? Maybe for my boss? I wonder if Gil would like it, though. Your name, girl. Oh. For Jill, then. For Jill. Never lose your star. From Kira Mickey. Filthy Saiyan. <laughs> oh, that's a pretty autograph. Thanks. No, thank you. 
I'm guessing someone with as many fans as you has had their fair share of stalkers, right? Well, there are two kinds of people that obsess over me. There are the shy ones that follow me everywhere, hiding just out of sight. And there's my fan club. What's the difference between them? The fan club follows me around a lot too, but they usually keep a distance. Actually, I think they're outside waiting for me right now. I... I see. They're also very organized. They make pretty good soldiers. All I'm saying is she's definitely Frieza. Yeah, for sure. She's gonna pull the wig off and she's gonna be like, Frieza! <laughs> Dirty Saiyans! Dirty Saiyans! I'm going to kill you now, Goku. <laughs> the others, the, the stalkers, are a bit sneakier and don't act in groups. I'm guessing those stalkers must be bothersome. Huh. Actually, they're not that bad. Stalkers are nice when you get used to them. Excuse me? <laughs> I remember one once protected me from being mugged. Alright, that does sound pretty nice. There's another one that breaks into my house once a week to make me breakfast. And she fails to see the problem? I fail to see the problem, honestly. I just wish they'd leave me my underwear drawer the same way they found it. <laughs> I take pride in how neatly I organize my underwear, you know? I take pride in my old liquor collection. I guess it's the same. Oh, we're gonna get that slap bass. Yeah. No, wait. It isn't. <laughs> yeah, you get me, Jill. Okay, one more drink before I go. By now, the state should be all organized, so the fallout should have settled. Isn't it a bit late for a concert? It's part of my gimmick. I always make concerts that go from night till dawn. That's pretty cool. In this one, I'm supposed to close with a song called Sunshine Stone. If everything goes as planned, and the weather forecast is accurate, the sun should come up just as I reach the climax of the song. That's pretty dope. I'd be depressed if they ask for your love is a drug as an encore, though. That sounds nice. Hey, I need to make people feel their tickets were worth the ridiculous price, you know? <laughs> Don't you think it sucks to pay for something only to find out you shouldn't have bought them? Yeah, one time I bought some expensive coffee in this one cafe. It tasted like filthy water with cream. I still don't know if it was the coffee or the girl that served it, but it was bad. Really, really Man, fucking that bad. that sucks. Speaking of which, do you have anything bitter? I really need to wake myself up. Let's see what I can find for you. Bitter. Yeah. Another sunshine cloud. You think that's? You think is there? You think there's a penalty for giving the same drink twice? No. Give her a fucking um. Give her a different one. There probably is. Let's see. Actually, what's? I wonder if there's something that, like, I wonder if we get different responses. Kind of want to give her the same. Drink well, I imagine twice. there's since like there's different alcohol in them. If there's like a, if it's like a threshold thing where it's like if they get this much alcohol, they become drunk. Mm. And I mean, um, there might be again responses based on giving them the drinks they like, drinks they yeah. don't, or different drinks. And you don't. know, there definitely is. Because you can, I think you can give them wrong drinks because we got an achievement for like having, like creating a perfect day, mm -hmm. or perfect like not fucking up any orders. If we, I wonder if we give her a bunch of alcohol, she might fucking. Yeah, oh, we might hear on concert? like uh, news and shit that she got too drunk for the concert. Right, let's try that. That'd be funny. <laughs> All right, that sounds good. On the rocks, mm -hmm. blended. Try this. Yeah, this works. So, how is it? It could be a bit sweeter, but it's delicious. So yeah, there's definitely there might have been a drink that was more optimal. A better choice. I figured it was for waking you up or something, so... Really nice, thanks. Hey, Jill, have you ever lost your identity? <laughs> Do you want to? <laughs> <laughs> I've lost my ID card a couple times, yeah. No, I mean your identity. Forgotten who you are? Oh, that's a menacing look on her face. Yeah. What's with the change in expression? No, not really. I did. 
Huh? Kira Mickey is just an artist name. At first, it was hard for me to play the part, you know? But I gained so much satisfaction from the concerts that I decided to invest myself. And I overdid it. How so? I became so invested in this character that I forgot who I was. Who I was before I became Kira Mickey. I really like having the or stars around I? it every time. Who did I like, or what did I like? Where does Kira Mickey end and I begin? I just don't know anymore. Sounds rough. What drove you to such a decision? The fact that I know I'm performing a noble duty. How? You have to deal with many stressful things in everyday life. Work, debt, sickness, insecurity, the black slime that comes out of the, su uh, out of the sewers every full moon. <laughs> You don't know what will await you every morning. I hate when the black slime comes out and fucking steals my dog. Yeah, seriously, and fucking eats my dog right up. Yeah, you gotta get you a new dog, you don't know if you'll make it back to bed that night. When measured, the cons of life outweigh the pros. People need something to cling to, and for many, I'm that thing. You are? During my concerts, they stop being themselves for four hours. They're not a nurse, an office worker, or a store clerk. They're freezer soldiers. <laughs> <laughs> For those four hours, they're just the freezer force. <laughs> no religion, gender, or social class divides them. They're they all, all the look same like Barbie level. dolls. <laughs> Damn, it really be like that. Come here, Shaq. <laughs> you fucking eating? I think I'm getting a fucking migraine. <laughs> I took some Advil. Oh, really? Yeah. All right, we'll, we'll try and get through this. All right. All right. When not in concert, I try to give them songs that will cheer them up, that will make their lives worth living. When I see that people call my name from the stage, I know they're thanking me. Thanking me for that single moment where they can be happy. That's what I love about the stadium. I'm down below while they're up high. If forgetting who I was before means that I can protect those smiles, so be it! I'll make that sacrifice as many times as needed. Matt making the sacrifice right now. <laughs> for real. Because I live for them. Because I know I help them. Matt is Kiramiki. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the star that always shines in the night sky. I'm the glow that will guide you through your sorrow. I'm the northern light that will show you your dreams. I am Frieza, motherfucker! <laughs> and don't you ever forget that. Huh. Fan club to me! We ride to the stadium! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Chase something else, huh? I suddenly feel the urge to ditch my shift and follow her. <laughs> Do you think she's telling the truth? I don't know, Gillen. Uh, are you making a fucking accent still? According to this article, making her real an name accent? is Michelle Kingston. Deployed about two years ago. Sean Kingston? <laughs> she did a few variety shows with her jazz band, but went solo afterwards. What was all that about? That talk about then? <laughs> Huh? She was drunk and was a very peculiar drunk. I knew it. We got her drunk and we got that. Yeah. Figured. That's cool. And that might not be because of that. Maybe, though. Still quite the motivational performer, though. No doubt. Boss, we're done. All right. <laughs> Dana's Australian, too, now? You feel like that's going to that girl? You feel like going to that girl's concert? Are you crazy? Nah. I don't think so. I don't have tickets anyway. Hey boss, does the name Red Comet ring any bells? Why, that was my moniker during my wrestling days. You're... huh? That's what they called me during my time in the Grand Slam Fighters. That's fucking dope. That is pretty dope. They saw me coming, but they couldn't stop me before I crashed into their heads. <laughs> 
Uh, any reason for being red specifically? Probably because red's dope. Also, she's got like red eyes. Yeah. That way I was three times. Is she an orc? <laughs> <laughs> How did you find that out? Do you like wrestling? A client mentioned in uh, mentioned it yesterday when he saw you. I just kind of remembered it. Ah, oh, I see. Her, I see. I should take you to a wrestling match sometimes. Maybe you'll like it. Maybe. In any case, Gil's cleaning up the glasses today, so I'll leave now. Take care. Oh, and boss? Don't cram anything on your head without thinking, please. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> nice. Grab a snack on the way home. It's on me. Oh, nice. So we got $300 for that. Good shit. We got flawless service. Some good tips. Ooh. We did good. 3000 Yeah, bucks. we're gods at 4, all. $4,000? Damn. Flawless service. Flawless voice acting. <laughs> <laughs> flawless service, but flawed voice acting is the way I would describe yeah. that. That sounds about right. Let's get a save in there. We'll save the mm -hmm. uh, all the new shit for tomorrow's. I mean, not tomorrow. Fucking, yeah. There the future. Be, yeah, for the next time we talk about Freezer Force. Mm -hmm. God, all right. that, that shirt that says slut really speaks to me. Does it? No. Why is that? Doesn't. <laughs> Doesn't at all. 